हेलो एवरीवन स्वागत है आपका एक और न्यू वीडियो में आज मैं आपको दिखाऊंगा डिबेट कंपटीशन का फाइनल राउंड फाइनल राउंड में दो टीम है दोनों में से जो जीतेगा उसको दस हज़ार देंगे मिलेगा और रनर आपको पाँच हज़ार देंगे मिलेगा आज हमारा डिबेट कंपटीशन थर्ड कैंपस में है तो आज मैं आपको थोड़ा सा थर्ड कैंपस का भी टूर करा दूँगा और दिखाऊँगा डिबेट कॉम्पटिशन में कौन जीतता है बहुत ही इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक है आज का डिबेट का लाइक जो लोग खुद के मर्जी से जेंडर अपना चेंज करते हैं उसके अगेंस्ट में बोलना है और उसके बारे में बोलना है तो देखते हैं आज का डिबेट कंपटीशन कैसा रहता है अब बने रहिए मेरे साथ अभी मैं निकल गया हूँ रूम से कैंपस थ्री के लिए थोड़ी देर में पहुँचकर आपको मैं वहाँ दिखाता हूँ अभी मौसम अच्छा हो रखा है माइनस चार डिग्री टेम्परेचर है कल परसों में तो माइनस बीस तेईस तक गया हुआ था आज स्नोफॉल भी दिखा रहा है शाम में अगर मैं उधर से डिबेट कंपटीशन से वापस आऊँगा स्नोफॉल हो रहा होगा फिर मैं आपको कवर करके दिखाऊंगा तब तक के लिए बाय ये देखो अभी मैं रूम से निकल के बाहर जा रहा हूँ ये बिल्डिंग के उस पार ये बस स्टॉप है बस स्टॉप पे बस आएगी फिर बस बोला था कि आज बर्फ़ होगी और अभी मैं बस जस्ट अभी बस स्टॉप पे आया हूँ और अभी स्नोफॉल स्टार्ट हो गया है मैं आपको अभी दिखाता हूँ बैक कैमरे से अभी अभी भी स्टार्ट हुए तो काफ़ी छोटे छोटे बर्फ गिर रहे हैं थोड़े देर में ही अच्छे से बर्फ गिरेंगे अभी देखते हैं आज कितना बर्फ गिरता है वैसे तो टेम्परेचर सही है माइनस डिग्री है और शाम तक भी माइनस फोर तक ही रहेगा अगर ठंड नहीं होगा फिर तो मज़ा आएगा ऐसे स्नो में टेम्परेचर बस वही माइनस बीस पर से नहीं जाना चाहिए फिर से प्रॉब्लम होती है माइनस बीस में थोड़ा बाहर रहने में चलिए मैं आपको स्नोफॉल दिखाता हूँ अभी अभी तो बहुत छोटा हो रहा है टेम्परेचर होगा कि नहीं कैमरा में मैं देखता हूँ अगर होता है तो मैं दिखाऊंगा ये देखो आप मैं बस स्टॉप पर खड़ा हूँ और अभी स्नो स्टार्ट हो गया अभी कैमरे में तो नहीं दिख रहा है बहुत छोटे छोटे बर्फ गिर रहे हैं थोड़े देर में स्टार्ट होंगे भारी बर्फबारी फिर देखते हैं आज का माहौल क्या रहता है अभी मैं बस से उतर के आ गया बस में बैठने से पहले स्नो हो रहा था अभी यहाँ उतरने के बाद टेम्परेचर माइनस दो हुआ और स्नो ये बारिश में बदल गया ये गलत हुआ बारिश होगी सारे स्नो पिघल के कीचड़ कीचड़ हो जाएगा चारों तरफ इससे अच्छा तो स्नो ही था टेम्परेचर थोड़ा माइनस झेल लेते स्नो होना चाहिए था आज बारिश गंदा हो जाएगा सब कुछ अभी मैं आ गया हूँ कैंपस थ्री के पास आपको मैं दिखाता हूँ कैंपस थ्री यहाँ से तो नहीं दिखेगा पास में चल के फिर दिखाता हूँ ये आ गया मैं कैंपस थ्री पे ये मेन गेट है यहाँ लिखा है आई मिस कैंपस नंबर थ्री यहाँ पे देखो स्नो कैसे इकट्ठा कर रखा है इसमें लेक्चर्स होते हैं फर्स्ट ईयर की भी क्लासेस यहीं लगेंगी हॉस्टल के जस्ट सामने ही है यहाँ पे बस लेक्चर लेक्चर हमारा लगता है और फर्स्ट ईयर की क्लासेस भी यहीं लगेंगी ये देखो आप ये कैंपस नंबर थ्री है पीछे वहाँ लंबा तक है दूर तक से भी रूम दिख रहा है उसमें डिबेट कंपटीशन चल रहा है मैं चलता हूँ यहाँ मैं अभी यहाँ दिखाता हूँ कैमरे में ये हॉल है यहाँ चल रही है अभी डिबेट कंपटीशन इस हॉल में डिबेट कंपटीशन चल रहा है Uh, 
Does it have to be here? But that doesn't mean that was the past, sir. Your argument was to the his the whole process. Yes, sir. You had to come up with the statement that even the hormones that we take there. Adults, they are being prevailed to do this under the under the society. We know that the trend is being followed at every stage in the, our life. If we, if uh, if an I and you are using social media nowadays, we all know. And even if uh, let's take an example that if my friend start exercising herself, I would also next day feel that I should also start it, right? Now, if my colleagues and my fellow mates around my society are being like, I are being a. Uh, transitioning themselves uh, a male is being uh, f uh, transitioning them to female and if someday i feel no no i don't feel like a woman and i don't feel like a girl in myself and i want to transition myself as a boy the next day and that that is a very i like i can say that it is a very uh, you know quick decision changing like, like i in this era in this age we are we are we just change our decision like rapidly today i want this next day i want that next day again i want this so that is not the case here. Now, if I just, we are not saying if there is a biological need, one should go for the surgery. If there is no biological need, if just a person is feeling this under the influence of something, we just are saying that there is always not a need. If I feel, it, it's not like I must go for it. Okay, so. Genders are there. You are pretty sure some two genders are there. Absolutely. But as a medical student, we know that there are only two biological genders. Yeah. And these minority of people that are transgender, biologically, that are born with that defect in them. And for them, when they undergo that surgery, what's the outcome of it? Is it the 72 genders or it's only male or female? Actually, the outcome, if I say male about the outcome, male or female, but biologically, it's male or female. But what about the fact that 70 other genders are there? We have all also, we need to include the psychology which is happening in these, uh -huh. in these people. Actually, they are being saying that they are agender. They are not uh, either of male or female, and they are not. Uh, they are non-binary. They are gender neutral. They, these problems are prevailing in the society, well, and I think we if, should talk about it. If a lady wants, you know, her pronouns as a female, as she wants her uh, people to call her a queen, yeah. maybe her husband might call her, maybe her dad might call her. That is be at home. But when it when it's at the whole society, then well, you know that it's mental problem. That has nothing to do deal with our topic here. We're dealing with the the, uh, the, uh, sorry, the surgery <coughs> teams, yes, gender transition surgery. Yeah. So we're, you know, I would like us to focus on these, because, not the. Because this option is also being preferred by 70 other genders also. They are also saying that they need. You can have the X to the female and before going to How the How many people they are feeling this type of thing? How many? Sir, it's, 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 it depends on the nation. Right? If I talk about the US, it has so to be. Something yeah. average we have talked about. Uh, you mean about the saving of this? Yes. But in the who are in the how many people they are feeling these things? If I have to compile it and if I have to make an estimate, I would be like around 60 percent of them would be. 60. And what about the risk? Uh, the patients they like uh, when they go into through the surgery. Sir, the risk as a as a medical professional, sir, the risks are the same as any other surgery. We never know if the patients are available, but but thankfully. Thankfully, the risks of these surgeries are not quite that, uh, got that uh, it doesn't put the patient's life into that jeopardy because we have such uh, good equipment and we, uh, we have the medical good history of the patient, we check their medical records to how we should go with the surgery. The, uh, the most things that can happen to the patient is they can feel a bit, uh, they can feel a bit lightheaded after surgery, a loss of memory, that's also temporary, with drugs we can cure that too. And in, some in such cases where we have a possibility we, that we can treat the patient with some another things you can say like psychiatric. If we can do that thing with the therapy, then why should we go on the surgery? Very good. I am defending that thing also. If a person <laughs> no, you are going to be very good. They don't have the Yes, from so let's proceed with the judges. Well, so at the end, you you are left to know. Sir, are you regretting it? <laughs> Sir, are you regretting your uh, opinion? <laughs> what is treatment? So we can use hormones for the treatment. Actually, second thing is surgery. Surgery is a, like uh, the main thing uh, uh, why we are uh, discussing here. Sir, exactly. The thing is, I the first line of defense for me was the hormone. Then I would have gone to the surgery, but they took the head off. <laughs> <laughs> You said gender affirmation care or uh, therapy should be our first concern. That's our point. That's why we are opposing it. 
our first concern from the very big beginning should be therapies rather than this. Right. That's why are you you are favoring it. That should be the majority part majority part of your debate, right? You yourself said that the priority should not be this thing. But uh, we we are saying that this should not be not be the priority, but the last option that we should opt for. If you you mentioned it as a last option, as if it's a it is a bad thing. Like I mentioned, no, not at all, sir. I am what saying and I am agreeing that. Next question. question. Uh, approved that uh, it is called as gender dysphoria. So it was till 2012 since it was a psychiatric disorder. And after the 2012, they have mentioned that it's not only the psychi uh, psychiatric psychological disorder, but it's also can be because of any genetical disorder. For example, uh, there's a um, PSF, uh, sorry, PFS, this testicular feminization syndrome. In this, the person, he is born with genotype male and a phenotype of female. He doesn't have a uterus, but he has a um, revoked testicles. So it doesn't matter whether he does an affirmation surgery or the hormonal therapy. So his hormones are already imbalanced. He is, his breast, breasts are developed. He has a vulva. His, his phenotype is as of a woman, but he also has a genotype of a male. First of all, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very, very good, interesting lecture. Yes. I'm a little bit surprised because <laughs> this is the first time I'm sitting here and uh, trying to define whose position is <laughs> good or bad. So what I want to ask you as a psychologist, first of all, Let's imagine that you have a family, and, and you have a child, and one day your child tells you, Father, I feel that my body is strange to me. I do not feel that this is my body, for example. Uh -huh. So I want to know what you feel first as a father. You will be worrying about uh, the reaction of uh, surrounding society Absolutely. or you will be worried about this fact that your child has this it's not problem but this yes. situation yes, yes, yes. okay so it's this is what i want to know it's a, it's a very good question sir uh, hopefully in uh, in the future if i have the uh, luxury to become a father and i have a son uh, and let's say if let's say for some reason the son is telling me this father i feel uh, i'm not in the right body i feel like that as a father, I, of course, will uh, look out the uh, social, so, social life too, how the people might take, take care of these things. Mm -hmm. And But first of all, he is my own blood. He is my flesh and bones. Mm -hmm. So I will take care of him. I will know what exact things he needs. You know, I, will take, I, will, uh, I will take him to the, uh, to the uh, medical profession, the professionals that know these things, and they can help me. Sir, uh, your son has this and that. Depending on whatever help I can uh, come up, you know, for him, I will do it. Mm -hmm. It's that thing. But of course, I will have to keep in mind all the uh, social things too. <laughs> but the majority focus will be all on my own child. So that's how it should be. Kirti, if you want to know. Yes, sir. If I would be in that position, my primary uh, response would always be to guide him on what to the right path. What is right for him and what is wrong for him. Mm -hmm. My, uh, uh, what, uh, my, I will ask him what caused that, that belief to happen to you. And uh, if uh, he, he or she tells me the belief and what caused that belief, I will uh, uh, approach that uh, cause and I will tell the solutions. But my first response should be that I will guide him or her to the right path, what nature has decided for that, for my child. You may be different. So uh, we all know that uh, old person, old people, they have their views. So that's why uh, this uh, debate is going on. Okay, so now, uh, now I think we can compile it. The human safety. No, you will take your time. Yeah. Can you give us? Yes, sir. Okay, sir. Because we also will have very. Now it's time for result. Let's see what is going to happen. Yeah, they are going to different room because they want to have a heavy, heavy call. What do you think? Like Who is going to be winning? Uh, like the topic was uh, medical surgery of transgender, but the topic also has social and legal aspects of it. So, like, and the favorite thing.
Thank you. 